Hi guys, it's Barnaby for Spurred On and this is your Friday edition of 7 o'clock Spurs. First up, transfer news. Bild in Germany say that we are interested, along with Schalke, in the man's attacking midfielder, Yunus Mali. Now, I know, you haven't heard of him. I haven't really heard of him that much either. I'm not a huge follower of the German league. However, he has been dubbed the new Meza Erzil. He's a Turkish international and he has a 9 million euro release clause. This, to me, sounds like a, a realistic kind of Paul Mitchell signing. He's not someone we know a great deal about, but he's obviously got talent. He's been talked about in Germany, just like Kevin Wimmer was, and maybe he can come and uh, take up the midfield slot that may well be allocated by Andros Townsend if he moves on this January. Let's see what happens. Second bit of news today, Spurs have been announced to be playing in next season's pre-season Champions Cup in the Australia leg. If you know what the Champions Cup is, it's where all the kind of biggest clubs in Europe go all around the world and play against each other, some in America, some in Australia. We'll be playing against Juventus uh, and Sydney at the MCG in Melbourne in July. Again, I think we're just trying to outreach as many fans as we can. We're actually quite big in Australia and playing against teams of the ilk of Juventus in a pre-season tournament can only help us. Although, I think it's fair to say we all worry a little bit about how many miles the players have to get under their legs in these pre-season tournaments. But, hey, it's all about the dollar in the pre-season, isn't it? You know Levy's thinking about that. Okay, and finally today, a bit of weird news as far as I'm concerned. Harry Redknapp, our ex-manager who got us fourth, fifth, fourth, I always think of him as a great Spurs manager, has come out and said that Maurizio Pochettino may well be a target for Chelsea now that they are without a manager. That's right, of course, Mourinho got sacked yesterday, which I think is hysterical because he's the best manager in the world, probably, uh, apart from Mopo, of course. But Harry has come out and been a traitor and said that he thinks Pochettino could go there. Personally, as far as I'm concerned, why would Pochettino want to go there? Seriously, obviously they've got a lot of money, but also they've got an aging squad. It would take a lot to do that, uh, to get them going again, as far as I'm concerned. And we know that Maurizio likes to work with young players and stuff, so I think it's a no-go as far as I'm concerned. Also, when has Daniel Levy ever done anything for Chelsea ever since? Ever since the Frank Arneson situation where, where Chelsea poached him, he just basically refuses to deal with them, so I can't see it happening. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter, at Spurred on TV. Have a great weekend and come on you Spurs against Southampton, come on. Just so you know, those games will be on the 18th and 25th of February. The 25th will be the game at White Hart Lane and 